OMG BG! Welcome back to another video guys. Today we have Beyblade Burst Super Z. This is the Long Bay Launcher Set. So we get a couple of add-ons and this is your DLC for Zed Achilles because we basically get extra pieces that we can actually upgrade Zed Achilles with. So that's pretty interesting. We have a launcher grip, we have a string launcher that's way longer than your B108 Bay Launcher. And we also get a recolored um, power trigger. So these are old accessories, but if you don't have them yet, you can get the set and you can get some add-ons. Uh, the plastic piece will only work with your Zed Achilles Bay. So there's a performance upgrade for your driver. So that's Zed Achilles without the driver upgrade. And then we have the Zed Achilles with the yellow driver upgrade. So it comes with that extra piece and also comes with like a little tool that you can customize the ability on your Zed Achilles. So the three modes, that's pretty interesting. We got attack mode, we got defense mode, and we got stamina mode. It depends on how much the red driver gets exposed at the bottom here. Man, so this is like a DLC for your Zed Achilles. We had Zed Achilles for so long. Dude, yeah. He never got an upgrade until now. So kind of like your, um, what? Beyblade Burst God, the God Chip and stuff like that. So it's nice to see like your main character getting an upgrade. That's pretty cool. Okay, so red theme. I Dude. feel like we have that exact one. Exact, that's exactly what I was gonna say, <laughs> yo. But again, like not everybody would buy all the products. So it's a nice variety for those who want this colorway, the red one, so. It's the classic Aiga Zed Achilles colors. Okay, so nice. do that. Let's take out the power trigger. Do I like the trigger? Yeah, the red trigger is actually pretty nice. We have the black ones. Okay, so we got the Ooh, trigger. Sick. So more grip power. And let's take a look at these two plastic pieces. Man, they're so small. Imagine you just like drop them and you lose them right away. Dude, if you lose that- Oh! oh. <laughs> now where did that go? Imagine you just like- Lose that. Oh. oh! Dude, did you lose that? Dude, did you lose that? Dude, did you lose that? Don't worry, guys, I found it. Alright, so just a quick recap we got Zed Achilles right here in its original parts, and the driver is Extend. So, Extend you usually would have two mode changes. So, one is like the tall mode, and one is the short mode. So, there's a slight uh, difference in height. So to upgrade our Zed Achilles, the extend driver, what we'll do is we'll take this tool that comes with the, that box. Okay, so once I stab this thing in, man, look, the Beyblade is now way taller. Woo! Just battle with that. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, guys. So that's not the modification. So um, what we'll do is we actually have to pull this back like this. Dang. So now, wow, like when Zed Achilles first came out, did we really even thought that this could exactly. happen? Exactly. Like, Who would have thunk? Takara told me thought it all out, man. Dude, they knew that they were going to juice us from the beginning. <laughs> they knew they were going to add this DLC pack for yeah. us to buy. Yeah. Oh, but are you mad? Just take my money. It doesn't just matter. Take money anyway. You guys did a good job. All this intricate stuff, Takara told me does really well. Okay, so can just pull this off and you can get this piece back but we're gonna actually add in our upgrade which is this yellow piece here so let's push it back in Whew. so that click so satisfying we actually have three different modes so the first step we have is stamina mode if we go a little bit higher we have defense and then if we go all the way up basically we get a whole flat so that's attack so the attack mode means that Zelda Achilles is in its tallest form right now. So that's pretty cool. So instead of two step uh, height change gimmick, we now have this like three mode change ability on Zed Achilles. Super smart design. Like, wow, who would have thought this little tool, these little plastic pieces can come off like that. So this is called the long bay launcher. So the string is longer compared to your regular bay launcher. So let's take a look at this. I have a regular one right here. So we're getting extra length so just that, that much more it's gonna give you a little bit more power and also i uh, noticed that i feel like the string is a uh, smoother too the so pole is nicer a, there's a improvement overall in quality so that's nice to see all right guys so let's do a test spin three, three two, two one, one go shoot 
Man, this string is so much longer. Yo, that attack mode. Yeah. You're actually aggressive. Yep, yeah, and it's tall when it's aggressive too. So let's try to change it to the lowest mode. So we have stamina mode. Let's give it a shot. Three, two, Three, two one, one, go shoot. Oh yeah, much more calm. Yep. So you're all over the place. Ooh. Okay guys, so that's a test spin. We gotta make sure we do a test battle, especially with this combination versus the new, uh, not Jane Fafnir, Geis Fafnir and its own upgrade set too. So we gotta make sure these two go against each other. Stay tuned for that battle guys. Make sure you like the video, subscribe. Tell us in the comments below what you guys think of these kind of designs and would you guys buy these like little upgrade sets? Cause I think that's a pretty interesting idea. I think it's a good thing that they're doing that. Um, it gives you more replay value because then we haven't like used Zeke these in a while and with this upgrade set now I feel like I want to use this guy a lot more. So that is true. That so, is true. Yeah, tell us in the comments below what you guys think of uh, this kind of like release and yeah, as always, geeks out.